Hi, everybody. Welcome to Cliffdale Elementary School. We are super excited to be working with you and your child this new school year. My name is Shalisa Hines, and I am the grade level chairperson for the first grade. My team members this year are Maureen Wisdom, Ophelia Sawyers, Shornette Forbes, Debbie Mertz, and Shauna K. Aries. And our TAs for this year is Ms. Johanna Barbara, Ms. Rita George, and Ms. Sharon McLean. So I want to begin today by telling you about our schedule that we will follow while we are in remote learning environment. The remote learning environment means that your child will participate in online learning lessons with their teacher. This is known as a synchronous learning. Your child will also participate in a asynchronous learning, which is when your child is working independently or on assignments online and paper and pencil activities. So let's take a look at what our schedule will look like here at Cliffdale Elementary. I'm going to share my screen with you so you can have a brief idea of what your, your child's day is going to look like. So this is what our schedule is going to look like during our remote learning. As you can see, students are going to arrive at 8 o'clock in the morning from 8 to 8.45. That's going to be group A. They're going to be doing their specials. Specials include music, art, PE, and guidance. And the asynchronous group, which would be group B, are going to be doing Education Galaxy, Sussex Maker, AR, iStation, or any assignments that your child teacher has left for them during that day. From 8.45 to 9 o'clock, we're going to have a little quick break just to get students prepared and ready for their next session. From 9 to 10 o'clock, that's going to be our literacy block. Literacy block includes reading, phonics, and um, language arts. Then from 10 to 10, 15 is another little break transition. Then from 10, 15 to 11 o'clock is our math instruction time. From 11 to 11.30, we're going to have a faculty and staff um, meeting that is actually going to be students' time for their lunch. And just to remind everyone, you can come to school, get your child's lunch. So that's going to be their time. All students are going to return at 1 o'clock. 1 o'clock is going to be either our science or social studies block. Then at 1.45 to 2, we are going to have our next break. And from 2 to 2.45, Group B, who are doing asynchronous activities in the morning, are going to be doing their special times in the afternoon. And Group A would then go to a asynchronous group, which would be Education Galaxy, Success Maker, AR, iStation, or any activities that your child's teacher has prepared for them. From 2.45 to 3 o'clock, we're going to do our daily closure. We're going to wrap up. And any announcements or any important um, things, we're going to share with your students at, um, at that time. So this is a brief thing, I mean, a brief little look at what our schedule is going to look like during the day. <clears throat> ja, I, we just want to let you know that um, please, just as they would have a desk at school, we would like for you to have a place for them to work at home as well. They should have their materials um, like paper, a notebook, um, their workbooks, or any manipulatives that we're going to use that day. They should all be ready to go. If you have any further questions about this schedule, please ask your child's teacher when you meet with them during their Google Meet session. And you can please click on the next slide and then click on your child's email address to send them your email address. If you have not heard from your child's teacher by August 11th, please, please call. Our phone number is 864-3442 to ensure that we have the correct contact information for you. 
We can't wait to meet each one of you and hope that each one have a great day. Bye.